Hey everybody, it's Deanna. Today's November 27, 2012. I'm going to try this again. I was about three quarters of the way through with my video because Ron had left for work, so I figured I'll, uh, I'll do it while he's on his way to work. And I heard my door unlocking, and in comes Ron. And I'm like, oh, what's going on? And I thought I shut the video off, but I didn't. And he proceeded to tell me that after being working for a week, the owner said, I'm bankrupt and the doors are closed. So after trying to find a job for two years and getting a job and being so happy that he had a job, they, they locked the doors. And I said a curse word on the video while it was going, so I'm not going to play that. Ron said, oh, you can't play that. And it wasn't the F word. It wasn't, I didn't drop the F bomb. But I called the guy something that I shouldn't have called him. God forgive me. But, um, and they didn't pay him. I don't even know if he's going to get paid for the week he worked. Um, they said to come back Friday, so we'll see. If not, I'm calling two news stations here locally and let them get his money for him. So, anywho. My way in. And I forgot to turn the camera on. So, my way, today's my 14 week post op video. And last week I weighed 268. Today I was 266.2 for a total loss of 1.8 pounds and a grand total of 65.6 pounds. And I love it. I just love it. I feel so good. I have so much energy. Everything's great. Um, I don't really have a lot to talk about other than my weigh-in. Um, oh, my, I had an NSV, Ron's birthday, and I don't know if any of you girls or guys even relate to this, and I am keeping it real. Hooters. We went to Hooters. Now, 14 weeks ago, I would not have went to Hooters. Ron and I have never went to Hooters. And the reason we have never went to Hooters, because I'm y'all are my family and I'm not lying, is jealousy, hating myself, not wanting to go to a restaurant where my boyfriend's going to be looking at these cute, sexy girls with this big fat obese woman sitting next to her so I refused to go and even my mom I'm like you know how I am and she said yes I do she said how was how was Hooters and I said it was awesome before we left I got all dressed and the girls came and did my hair and makeup which I'm gonna put some pictures at the end of the video so y'all can see what a 10 and a 14 year old girl did to me it was amazing absolutely amazing i've never been able to do my makeup or my hair like these girls did i got a little bit of curl in it today i was playing with my new uh spiral spiral curling iron but it doesn't look anything like it did when julia did it so i will put some pictures at the end of the video so you can see it but i got all ready and i got dressed and i looked at ron and i said you know what them hooter girls they don't have nothing on me just saying just saying they didn't have nothing on me that night and I felt good I liked what I saw when I looked in the mirror and we had a really great time it was a lot of fun so that is my number one NSV since surgery is being able to go and enjoy you know things and not be worried even though I know Ron's coming home with me but in my obese brain um, it was like he's going to leave with one of them girls because they look a lot better than you do. So that's just keeping it real, you guys. Um, I wanted to show y'all something I made for my dear friend Chris, uh, Crystal um, that sent me that big, huge box of beautiful clothes. And um, the the resin jewelry that I made, like the little um, the little thing, the little necklace that I made for um, Belinda with. Uh, her team. Oh, this stuff here. This is a Steelers one that somebody ordered. Steelers Diva. 
this is this is resin it's a two-part epoxy resin that I buy and um, I have the that's the medium-sized mold well I ordered the large molds a while back and I haven't done anything with them and I thought you know as you can see how thick that is it's over a half inch thick but I went on Miss Crystal's wall and found a picture of her and Damien from Thanksgiving and I made them a Christmas tree ornament. Whoops. Whoa. I made them a Christmas tree ornament to hang on their tree with their picture and it's all framed in this pretty gold glittered ribbon. So, and she saw it on my Facebook wall and loves it. So, that's going out to the mail to Crystal. Jody, Tammy, Alicia, your packages went out a little while ago, and they should be there. Make sure you look inside your phone cases, because I made you guys all something special in there, and um, I've got some other packages sitting here that I'm getting ready to mail a few surprises. Now, um, I guess that's really all... I'm looking around. Oh, I got this awesome card Whoop! from Mr. Robert Reno. And I love this. When, motiv when motivation fails, you turn to your most powerful source, your dedication. I love that. And it's from Rob Dexter in Little Blue. And it's a personal message, so I'm not going to read it. But thank you, Rob, for my card. I'm going to add that to my many, many cards. I'm going to have to buy another bulletin board. I'm decorating for Christmas. Ron just left to go donate plasma to make a little bit of cash. And he put the tree up for me before he left. So I'm going to start decorating the tree. I've got a, all my... I collect Santa Clauses. I have a lot of them. And I didn't even put them all out. But I put a few out. And I got my Yankee Candle burning that smells like pine Christmas trees. It smells so good in here. But I may do a video later when I get the tree done so I can show you guys everything. My bathroom's all decorated with my snowman shower curtain and stuff. So I'm not going to make this any longer. Thank you to all my new subscribers. I have subscribed to you guys. I look forward to following your journeys. To all my family that has subscribed to me. You're not my friends or my family. And I love you guys. And I thank you for your support. I thank you for all your sweet and kind words on Facebook, on my photos and everything else. I love you guys, and stay tuned and watch for those photos from our night at Hooters. Love you guys, and God bless you. Bye.